Hi, this is Luke for Production Expert, and this is Inject from Audio Movers. Inject is a door audio plugin that sends and receives audio between apps or multiple USB interfaces on your system. It's different to Audio Movers' other products as its sole purpose is to move audio within a studio or inside your door rather than between studios as with Listen To products. This can be done without having to change your playback engine as well, and because it uses Core Audio or WDM, Injects can be used in any DAW on Mac or Windows. Injects also features a built-in recorder, letting you grab audio quickly from hardware or virtual sources. This has a built-in sample rate converter and supports multiple channel inputs and outputs, so you don't have to worry about channel mismatches or sample rate mismatches stopping the show. I'm using it in four ways today, and the first way, at its simplest, is simply to fire audio away from my main audio interface and towards my laptop speakers. So if I just disable the local throughput and then just go to my output over here, I can get go into the drop down and fire the audio at my built-in output. It's a very quick way just to check on laptop speakers. The second way I'm using Inject is to use a second audio interface to record directly into my DAW. Really handy if your DAW only supports one playback device. So I'm plugged into my second interface and if I bus this channel carrying Inject into an audio track I can just print that. This is me recording on my second interface. Alternatively I can record straight into Inject itself. Just hit record, so that's recording anything that's hitting the plugin drop that into my DAW, just hit record, so that's recording anything that's hitting the plugin. And that has the added advantage of avoiding any sample rates mismatches as well. So a useful little tool for grabbing audio there from any device. Similarly, a third way to use Inject is to record virtual audio. So I've got another auxiliary and another audio track to record the results. I select Inject Virtual Driver, find a suitably informative and entertaining podcast in my web browser, hit play, and away I go. It's important to get the right references, right? But if you if you do have a reference that's similar and you're comparing, you know, the chorus of one and your chorus, I think it can be quite good to sort of uh, understand the energy. And the fourth way I'm using Inject is for talkback. So this lets me use any old spare device lying around. I'm using a webcam mic. I've selected that as my external input and there it is. Now I can just use any old thing as talkback without tying up any interface inputs. Very useful. So that's four ways to use Inject from Audio Movers. Multiple devices with any DAW on Mac or Windows. To find out more and to read our full article, head over to the Production Expert blog. Thank <laughs> you.